Turkey's defense industry recently shocked the global stage by unveiling cutting-edge combat drones and AI-powered robotic systems, evoking comparisons to the power and influence of the historic Ottoman Empire. This high-tech arsenal showcases Turkey's strides toward military autonomy, boasting advancements in drone swarming, autonomous targeting, and AI-driven reconnaissance. With AI-enhanced combat tools and next-generation robotics, Turkey aims to solidify its position as a formidable force, stirring international attention and reshaping regional dynamics. The Roketsan Tayfun is a short-range ballistic missile developed by Turkey's prominent defense contractor, Roketsan. This missile, showcased in recent military parades, is Turkey's response to increasing regional threats and demonstrates its growing missile production capability. Tayfun boasts a range estimated between 300 and 600 kilometers, depending on payload configurations, and is designed to deliver precision strikes against high-value targets, including infrastructure, air bases, and other military assets. Equipped with advanced guidance systems, Tayfun is capable of evading missile defenses through maneuverability and high-speed capabilities, making it a formidable addition to Turkey's tactical missile arsenal. With robust R&D investment and support from the Turkish government, Tayfun represents a critical step towards self-sufficient missile production. Turkey's deployment of Tayfun is expected to enhance its deterrent posture and strengthen its strategic influence in regional security affairs. Developed by Roketsan and Asilsan, the Hisar-O is a medium-altitude air defense missile system designed to protect Turkish military assets and critical infrastructure from aerial threats, such as aircraft, helicopters, drones, and missiles. Part of Turkey's Hisar family, Hisar-O fills the medium range gap with a range of approximately 25 kilometers and an altitude interception capability of up to 10 kilometers. The Hisar-O system integrates with Turkey's radar and command and control systems to provide real-time tracking and intercept capabilities. Utilizing its radar-guided interceptor missiles, his RO can engage multiple targets simultaneously thanks to its advanced radar and tracking system. His RO includes modern anti-jamming technology and advanced radar systems to ensure effectiveness in electronic warfare environments. With Turkey's evolving geopolitical situation, his RO plays a crucial role in enhancing Turkey's layered air defense structure. As part of a comprehensive, domestically produced defense network, his RO contributes to Turkey's goal of reducing dependency on foreign defense imports. The Aksungur is a high-endurance UAV developed by Turkish Aerospace Industries for tactical and strategic missions. First introduced in 2019, Aksungur has been designed to serve both civilian and military roles with a focus on surveillance, reconnaissance, and carrying out precision strike missions with various payload options. Aksungur can carry out versatile roles by equipping a range of munitions, including laser-guided missiles, smart munitions, and sensors for surveillance. With a wingspan of around 24 meters and powered by twin PD-170 diesel engines, the Aksungur has a maximum endurance of over 50 hours, depending on its payload, and can reach an altitude of 40,000 feet. This enables it to monitor large areas continuously, providing strategic intelligence and operational support in military engagements. The drone's versatility has garnered international attention, with potential export opportunities arising in countries interested in expanding their UAV fleets. With an emphasis on domestic production, TAI has leveraged Turkey's expanding defense sector, reinforcing the country's aim for technological independence in military applications. The Aksungur demonstrates the Turkish defense industry's commitment to producing homegrown solutions in UAV technology, representing Turkey's ambition to be a prominent player in the international drone market. The Alpagu is a lightweight, portable, fixed-wing loitering munition developed by STM, a Turkish defense firm. Designed for rapid deployment by a single soldier, the Alpagu drone offers a flexible and efficient way to engage enemy targets without the need for larger, more complex systems. It is equipped with real-time video capability, GPS, and other targeting technologies that allow for precise engagements. Once launched, the drone can locate, track, and strike targets autonomously or with operator input. 
weighing around 2 kilograms, Alpagu can reach speeds of up to 120 kilometers per hour and has a flight time of approximately 10 minutes, which is sufficient for short-range tactical missions. Its portability and ease of deployment make it ideal for infantry units needing rapid, on-the-go support in challenging terrains or urban environments. Alpagu represents a significant advancement in asymmetrical warfare, allowing forces to quickly neutralize high-value targets with minimal risk to personnel. The Alpagu system aligns with Turkey's broader strategy to bolster its asymmetric warfare capabilities. The Cyper, also known as the Cyper Project, is Turkey's ambitious long-range air defense system developed collaboratively by Asilsan, Roketsan, and Tubitak Sage. Intended to rival established systems like the Patriot and S-400, Cyper is designed to provide high-altitude and long-range interception capabilities against aircraft, drones, and ballistic missiles. Once operational, it will be the centerpiece of Turkey's layered air defense strategy, which includes other indigenous systems like Hizar-A and Hizar-O. Expected to reach a range of around 100 kilometers, Cyper's advanced radar and missile technology enable it to engage high-speed aerial targets in complex electronic warfare conditions. The development of Cyper aligns with Turkey's objective of achieving self-sufficiency in defense, particularly in critical technologies like air defense that have historically been imported. The Marlin, developed by Turkey's Asilsan, is an advanced naval platform designed for various maritime operations. With its autonomous capabilities, the Marlin is equipped for ISR missions, as well as surface warfare, anti-submarine warfare, and mine countermeasures. It features a modular design, allowing integration with various payloads such as sonar systems, electronic warfare tools, and weapon systems. The Marlin USV can operate autonomously or be remotely controlled, making it highly adaptable to different operational needs. Its robust design and sensor systems ensure high-performance navigation and target detection, even in challenging maritime environments. The USV is particularly suitable for use in littoral operations and can engage in asymmetric warfare scenarios effectively. The USV can be deployed for missions involving mine detection and clearance, protecting critical naval and coastal infrastructure, or in multi-domain operations alongside drones and other unmanned vehicles. The Bayraktar Akinci developed by Turkish aerospace company Baykar, is a cutting-edge unmanned combat aerial vehicle that represents a significant leap in drone technology. Designed to perform a wide array of tasks, the Akinci is known for its versatility, long endurance, and ability to carry a variety of advanced weaponry. This Yukavi is a crucial asset in modern warfare due to its capability to operate at high altitudes and its proficiency in both intelligence gathering and combat roles. One of the standout features of the Akinci is its ability to operate at altitudes of up to 40,000 feet, which significantly expands its operational scope. This high altitude capability, combined with its endurance of over 24 hours, allows the drone to undertake prolonged missions without the need for frequent refueling. This endurance is critical for persistent surveillance, intelligence collection, and executing strategic strikes deep into enemy territory. Songar is a low-altitude, unmanned combat aerial vehicle, UAEV, developed by Asis Guard for the Turkish Armed Forces. It includes a Quadrator UAEV, a ground control station, and ground support equipment. It operates in both autonomous and manual flight modes, featuring route planning, autonomous flight, and autonomous return to base in critical battery charge level and data link disconnection situations. It can transmit telemetry data and images simultaneously. Songar has an operational range of approximately 10 kilometers and is equipped with both daylight and infrared cameras. It is fitted with several built-in weapons and can remotely destroy targets. The maximum takeoff weight when fully equipped and armed is 45 kilograms. It operates at a height of 400 meters above ground level and a maximum elevation of 2.8 kilometers above mean sea level. The drone is dust resistant, complying with the IP67 standard and has GPS and global navigation satellite system compatible navigation capability. The Kalkin Spy Drone is a state-of-the-art surveillance and reconnaissance drone developed by Turkey. Designed for intelligence gathering missions, the Kalkin Drone represents a significant advancement 
in Turkey's unmanned aerial vehicle capabilities. Its primary role is to perform surveillance and reconnaissance missions over various terrains, providing real-time data to military commanders. The Kalkan is equipped with high-resolution cameras, infrared sensors, and advanced electronic warfare capabilities, allowing it to detect and track enemy movements from a significant distance. One of its standout features is its low observability, designed to reduce its radar cross-section and heat signature, making it highly stealthy and difficult to detect. In addition to its primary surveillance role, the Kalkan spy drone can be equipped with a variety of payloads to suit different mission profiles. The drone's endurance and range are optimized for long-duration missions, allowing it to remain airborne for extended periods, covering vast operational areas without needing frequent refueling or recharging. The Zaha Marine Assault Vehicle is an amphibious combat vehicle developed by Turkish defense company FNSS, designed to support Marine forces in landing and combat operations. Built specifically for amphibious warfare, Zaha is capable of transporting personnel and equipment from sea to land, offering protection and firepower in various battlefield conditions. It is highly maneuverable on both land and water, allowing for swift transitions during amphibious assaults. Zaha is equipped with a machine gun and the automatic grenade launcher, providing significant firepower to support infantry during assault operations. Its modular armor system ensures protection against small arms fire and shell fragments, while the vehicle's V-shaped hull design enhances mine and IED protection. The vehicle's ability to carry up to 21 fully equipped soldiers allows for efficient troop deployment during beach landings. With its high level of protection, firepower, and amphibious capabilities, Zaha significantly enhances the operational reach of marine forces, making it a critical asset in Turkey's amphibious warfare strategy. The PARS-3 is an advanced multi-wheeled armored vehicle family developed by FNSS, designed to meet the needs of modern military forces. PARS-3 is renowned for its high mobility, superior protection, and modularity, allowing it to be customized for a wide range of missions, including reconnaissance, troop transport, and combat support. The PARS-3 is equipped with a powerful engine, all-wheel drive, and an independent suspension system which gives it exceptional performance across various terrains, from deserts to urban environments. Its amphibious capability further enhances its operational flexibility, allowing it to participate in river crossing and amphibious assault missions. Inside, the PARS-3 offers a spacious and ergonomically designed cabin that can accommodate up to 12 personnel, depending on configuration. Its turret can be equipped with various weapon systems, including machine guns, automatic cannons, and anti-tank guided missiles, providing substantial firepower to support troops in combat. The PARS-3 has been exported to several countries, solidifying its reputation as a reliable and versatile armored vehicle suitable for a wide range of military operations. Turkey's Anka-3, an advanced jet-powered drone developed by Turkish Aerospace Industries, represents a significant step in Turkey's unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV, evolution. Anka-3 is a stealthy, unmanned combat aerial vehicle designed for high-end reconnaissance, combat, and intelligence-gathering missions. Its key features include a low observable design that enhances its stealth capabilities, making it ideal for operations in contested environments. Recent updates have focused on refining the drone's aerodynamic shape to minimize radar visibility, significantly improving its range, speed, and payload capability. The Anka-3 is expected to support a wide variety of missions, ranging from intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance to air-to-ground strikes and potentially electronic warfare operations. This advanced drone is also designed to carry a diverse range of munitions, giving it exceptional flexibility in different combat scenarios and making it a versatile asset on the battlefield. The Khan is Turkey's first indigenous fifth-generation fighter jet marking a significant milestone in the country's aerospace and defense industry. The Khan is designed to incorporate advanced technologies that position it as a formidable asset in modern air warfare. Among its most notable features are its stealth capabilities, achieved through advanced design techniques that reduce its radar cross-section and improve its survivability in hostile environments. 
A key aspect of the Khan fighter jet is its emphasis on artificial intelligence technologies. These include sensor fusion, which allows the aircraft to integrate data from multiple sensors to provide a comprehensive situational awareness to the pilot. Advanced data links enable seamless communication and data exchange with other aircraft and ground units, enhancing coordination and mission effectiveness. The potential integration of autonomous combat capabilities represents a significant step forward in AI development, enabling the jet to make real-time decisions in complex combat scenarios without human intervention. The Bayraktar TB3 is an advanced UAV developed by the Turkish company Baykar. Following the success of its predecessor, the Bayraktar TB2. With a folding wing design, the TB3 is tailored for naval operations, enabling it to launch from short runways or ship decks, enhancing Turkey's maritime capabilities. The TB3 features a wingspan of approximately 14 meters and a maximum takeoff weight of around 1,450 kilograms. The UAV is powered by a single turboprop engine which allows it to achieve a maximum speed of 300 kilometers an hour. The TB3 can operate at an altitude of up to 30,000 feet and has an endurance of more than 24 hours, making it suitable for long duration missions. The UAV is capable of conducting a wide range of missions, including intelligence, surveillance, reconnaissance, and precision strikes against ground and sea targets. The TB3 incorporates advanced avionics autonomous flight capabilities, and AI for improved navigation, targeting, and situational awareness. The UAV's deployment on the TCG Anadolu will enable Turkey to conduct UAV operations far from its mainland, providing strategic flexibility and extending its operational reach in the Mediterranean, Aegean, and Black Seas. In August 2024, at the International Defense Industry Fair in Istanbul, Turkey unveiled an ambitious new air defense concept called the Steel Dome, Kalik Kuba. Aimed at competing with Israel's renowned Iron Dome, the Steel Dome represents Turkey's latest effort to strengthen its defense capabilities amidst growing regional security challenges. The system is being developed by leading Turkish defense companies, including Azelsan and Roketsan, both of which have extensive experience in cutting-edge military technology. Unlike conventional defense systems, the Steel Dome is designed to integrate a wide range of technologies to create a robust and adaptable defense network. Central to its effectiveness is its ability to utilize network-centric technologies and artificial intelligence. This allows the system to process vast amounts of data in real time, helping it accurately identify and neutralize various threats, including rockets, missiles, drones, and even artillery fire. Jackal is a small, light, and compact unmanned aerial vehicle designed and developed by British Flyby Technology, Turkish Fly Balas Technology, and Maxwell Innovation. The Jackal drone, equipped with missiles capable of striking armored vehicles, is approaching its first order. Armed with Martlet missiles, which have a warhead weight of 3 kilograms, it can effectively destroy APCs and IFVs. This offers an intriguing solution that could undermine the standard tactics of using attack helicopters. Combining a drone with man pads to counter attack helicopters appears to be an ideal countermeasure against the tactic of helicopters hiding behind terrain. However, with such an anti-aircraft drone, this tactic becomes ineffective. This type of weaponry potentially makes attack helicopters, which can engage targets in a non-line of sight mode, seem powerless. Thanks for watching and make sure to hit the like button, subscribe, and put notifications on to stay updated on everything related to AI, robotics, and military technology.